Jai Gurudev, Nakul Dhawanji, could you please introduce yourself briefly and share, share how you first encountered Yoga Vasistha? Sure, I'm Nakul Dhawan and my journey with Yoga Vasistha began during a retreat where a guru introduced me to this profound text. It instantly resonated with me due to its deep philosophical insights and practical wisdom. What aspects of Yoga Vasistha do you find most impactful in your spiritual journey? The concept of understanding the illusory nature of the world Maya and the path to liberation Moksha through self-realization are incredibly impactful. It teaches one to transcend the mind's limitations and attain true inner peace. Could you elaborate on how Yoga Vasistha addresses this concept of self-realization? Certainly, Yoga Vasistha explains that self-realization involves transcending the mind's dualities and realizing one's true nature as pure consciousness. It emphasizes deep contemplation and meditation to achieve this understanding. How has studying Yoga Vasistha influenced your spiritual practices and daily life? It has significantly deepened my meditation practice and enhanced my ability to stay detached yet engaged in daily life. Understanding its teachings has brought a profound sense of peace and purpose to my existence. In your opinion, what makes Yoga Vasistha relevant in today's world? Despite being an ancient text, Yoga Vasistha's teachings are timeless. Its insights into the nature of reality, the mind and liberation offer invaluable guidance in navigating modern challenges with wisdom and clarity. How do you think aspiring spiritual seekers can approach studying Yoga Vasistha effectively? Patience and contemplation are key. One should approach it with an open heart and a willingness to question deeply ingrained beliefs. Regular practice of meditation alongside study helps in internalizing its profound teachings. Lastly, could you share a memorable teaching or passage from Yoga Vasistha that has personally inspired you? One of my favorite teachings is about the nature of consciousness being the only reality and everything else being transient. It reminds me to focus on the eternal rather than getting caught, caught up in the ephemeral. Jai Gurudev.